Hello everyone. Welcome back to another video. So in today's video I'm going to rank all races v4 in Black's Fruits update 20. Sorry because I haven't uploaded a new video for several days. By the way, with about 2k more subscribers we can reach 100k subscribers. So for those of you who haven't subscribed, make sure to press the subscribe button. Let's get started. In 6th place is Rabbit. Beforehand I want to say that it's not, because a race is in last place, that he is so useless. Well, all races are very useful and very off depending on the user. Okay, let's just discuss why Rabbit is in 6th place. As you know Rabbit is the race, that has the highest mobility out of all races. This race is very fast. Of course this is a plus point for this race, and is very useful in certain cases. Even though they have the highest mobility than other races, Rabbit is very lacking in defense capabilities. This race only has a plus point in speed, so that's why this race is in 6th place. In 5th place is Cyborg, as you know. In recent times I have often used this race in several of my videos. Of course, this race also has advantages and disadvantages. In the update, these 20 races have become quite useful, since several new C events have started to appear. Cyborg have become a race that is useful for killing C events easily. Not only that, this race is also very useful for PvP, especially the aftershock ability that you can use when using V4 to attack your enemy. It is very useful in making your opponent unable to use Ken Haki, as well as taking damage slowly. However, if we only talk about PvP or advantages in grinding, I think there are still some races that are superior to Cyborg. So yeah. In 4th place is Angel, you have a 12.5% chance of getting this race, when you first join this game, it has the same chance for Shark and Rabbit. Angel race pretty good in some situations. Firstly, you can use this race to grind, raid bosses, raid. With the King's Rule ability, you can create a stun effect around the player's area, so like a raid, when the bosses appear. By using the king's rule ability the bosses will be stunned, and you just have to deal damage using M1 fighting style or sword. And secondly, you have an advantage in the air. If your enemy uses fruit that is strong in the air, then with the prince of the skies ability you can fly, and can do damage using anything in the air without falling to the ground. So that's it. In third place is human. Well when the new V4 race just appeared, you definitely know that this race was very superior at that time. For now, human is still a very strong and op race, especially if you use it for PvP. This is because humans have a high damage buff for their users. That's why human used to be the top tier as the best race for PvP. Yes, I think now they are still one of the best top tier races for PvP. In second place is the Gal. This race is very off, and what makes this race very good is, because one of its passives is Life Leech. Life Leech allows you when the user hits a player using a fighting style, heals 25% of the damage done to said player. I think this is a very useful ability, especially when you are in a dying position. You can use fighting style moves on your opponent, it will restore several thousand of your health. And I think this race seems to have several advantages over every race, such as having faster speed, at night, as well as extra defense and extra damage, etc. And in first place is Shark. Maybe some of you know that this race has been hit by nerf, but I think Shark still deserves to be in first place. You probably know how annoying it is, when you are hunting for a sea event and always die in the ocean. And by using this race you don't need to worry about damage from seawater anymore. 
and for PvP it's also very useful. You can avoid one-shot combos from your opponent using the V3 ability from this race. And Leviathan's armor ability is also very useful, which can make you immune to your opponent's attacks. So yeah. So that's all. I hope this video is useful for you. And among all the races available, which is your favorite race? Let me know in the comments.